What's good, Twain? This is everyone's favorite news program, Twain TV. I'm Olivia. And I'm Victoria. And our job is to bring you all the latest news. Today is Tuesday, November 11th, 2014. Now here's to take a look at today's report. Attention NJHS members, the next meeting will be this Thursday, November 13th, during the first block of the after school program. It is expected that you turn in your guidelines and expectations forms to student services if you are running for an office. Don't forget to come prepared to give a one minute to two minute speech for your desired officer position. See Ms. Pilati or Ms. Diatli for more info. See you Thursday. Hey you, yeah, that's right, you. What are you up to this week? Well, maybe you should check out Edison's production and Green Gables. It runs this Wednesday through Saturday, November 12th through 15th. Obviously, you should be going to Broadway Desserts on Thursday, so pick another day. Tickets are first for students are only $6, but aid at the door. Check out edisondrama.com for more info. Did you know Twain has an SEA? Well, Mr. Nisley and Ms. Moeller have some information about how you can play a bigger role here at school. Do you want to help make Twain a better place with a small time commitment? For only meeting twice a month, you can make a huge difference. You can help us plan Tiger Night. You can meet with Mr. Chong and other administrators to make both your school and community a better place to be. You can also help us plan Spirit Week and other school events. This Thursday, we will be having a call-out meeting for the SCA. It's going to be held Block 1 in Ms. Muller's room, 144. Again, if you're interested in the Student Council Association or any of the things we mentioned or any of the things that you can come up with, then sign up at lunch for Block 1 of the After School Program this Thursday. We hope to see you there. Good to know. Some Mural Club members, don't forget you must turn in your form by tomorrow to reserve your spot in Mural Club. This week begins painting, so get ready to get messy. Keep bringing in the treats. The Treats for Troops campaign is in full effect. <laughs> the Treats for Troops campaign is in full effect. Just bring your Halloween candy in and place it in one of these boxes at lunch. This is especially true today on Veterans Day. Just think of those who have served our country and think of what you can do to brighten their day. Okay, it's time for the next installment of Twain's Got Talent. Jonathan is an 8th grader who is here to share his piano talents with everyone. Check it out. Hello, my name is Jonathan Chesky and I've been playing piano since... Um, I was five years old or something, I don't know. Um, this year I'm going to be playing Burleys and it's going to be an awesome uh, time at Twain's Got Talent! Jonathan in the eighth grade playing for Elise on the piano. Let's check it out. from the library and turn them into Mr. Schechter in room 148 so you can be the next episode of Twain's Got, Got Talent. Talent. We're your hosts, Annalise and Olivia. See, See you next time. Awesome job, Jonathan. Now do you want to show off to everyone here at school? Share your talent with us. Just get a form from the library and turn it into Mr. Schechter in room 148. You too can be a star here on Twain TV. 
If you received a Nerd Herd application last week, remember that the deadline is this Friday, November 14th, to get them in. Drop them off at room 114. See Mr. Rocho with any questions. Tiger Knight. Dancing. Tiger Knight. Video Game Party. Tiger Knight. Minute to Win at Games. Tiger Knight. Prizes. Tiger Knight. A Fun Night with Friends. Tiger Knight. Friday, November 21st. Wait, Mockingjay? You totally can see that later. Trust me. You don't want to miss this party. Guess what, Patriots? It's finally time to reveal your Patriots t-shirt. That's right. Here it is, folks. The best Patriot t-shirt yet. Oh. Wait. Where's the design? You know, Patriots, it would be totally lame if you were the only um, team to not have a t-shirt design in five years. Come on, guys. Disappointed with your shirt, Patriots? That's because nobody has submitted a design yet. Get them in by Friday, people. It's time once again for today's birthdays. Happy birthday to Joshua. We hope you have a fantastic day. Now here's what's on your plate today from the cafeteria. Baked chicken tenders with brown rice, beef teriyaki with brown rice, and fruit roll. Choice of two vegetables, butternut squash, steamed broccoli, baby carrots with sugar snap pea garnish. Choice of one fruit, applesauce or fruit crisp. Today's song is dedicated to all the veterans and those who have vets in their family. That's all we have today for you from the studio. I'm Olivia. And I'm Victoria. Listen up for the Administrator's Corner after these messages. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter and Instagram. And check out YouTube.com slash TwainMSNews to watch other News Crew productions. Have, have a tied up Tuesday, Twain! Good morning, Mark Twain. Here's today's Daily Joke. What do you call an underwater spy? James Pond. <laughs> Have a great day, Twain. Good morning, Twain. Just want to start off by, um, again, saying that today is Veterans Day, so we just want to extend a heartfelt and sincere thank you to all of our veterans. Students, if you know a veteran, be it a parent, a sibling, maybe a staff member here at Twain, a neighbor, a grandparent, a family member, please be sure to extend a heartfelt thank you to them as well. All buses were in and on time today. Again, all buses were in and on time. And just a reminder, students, yesterday you had the SRNR review by our um, assistant principals. Please be sure to remember the three R's, being respectful, responsible, and right on time, regardless of where you are in the school building. That means in the hallways, in the cafeteria, in the classrooms, wherever you are. Please remember the three R's. Have a terrific Tuesday, Twain.